Here you are, wandering the dimly lit halls of an abandoned mall. And something seems amiss. It's quiet. Too quiet. The hairs on the back of your neck stand as you hear a sprinting behind you. Then the burst of behind. You curse under your breath as your screen dims to black. And the name you know all too well pops up. Killa. Well, it's time for revenge, my comrades. In this short guide, I'll take you from avoiding Killa to hunting him with a few simple tips and tricks. First tip, just make him kill himself. Kill him. I don't even see him because of the grenade. I killed him. You killed him already? I'm, I'm taking see? it. First things first, your kit. What are you bringing in? A high armor pen round is big part of killing Killa. His face shield may be level six, but the rest is only level four. And his armor is level 5, so M995, 7M1, M80, or BS rounds should do the trick. Also a scope. Interchange has a lot of long hauls where you can spot Killa before he spots you. Big mags also help if you end up getting close and personal with him or you need to stun lock him. Last is bringing a few nades for a potential easy kill. I use these strats on scav runs also, so you don't need good armor, but it helps if you make a mistake. He is running Inglock though, so it's not gonna help a lot. Upon loading in, take a moment to see where you are and find an entrance on the side of the building. Killa patrols the middle and you don't wanna walk right up onto him, so avoid the front entrance or the Goshen's rear entrance. And avoid the hole into the ground by Kibba. He's notorious for sitting right on that corner there, and he'll shoot you before you see him. Once you've entered the mall, make your way to one of the four ways to the top floor and start your overwatch. I prefer the rear entrances near the Goshen because they don't make as much noise and you don't attract as much attention. He walks in this path, but he can stop and camp in stores like Adidas, Manus, Brutal, General, Viking for periods of time marked on this map. When looking for him, take quick peeks to avoid aggroing him, then once he's spotted, you have to decide the best option on how to kill him. If he's sitting still and not aggroed, a nade can easily end his life. Don't even re-peek if he's just sitting crouched somewhere, just toss it over the edge and peek after it goes off. If he's walking away from you, then take quick shots at the back of his head. Should be a quick way to drop him if you have the armor pen. If he's coming towards you, there are a few options. Option one is reposition, and see if you can get him looking away from you, as that's the easiest shot. But be aware, he's now taking the shortest path to you, so listen for the escalators. You can catch him running up them for easy shots on his back, or you can try and hit him in the top of the head to drop him quickly. Option three is stun lock him. Killa has this effect where shooting him a lot will lock him up and stop his shooting. This option is the most risky because if you start missing shots, he could end your raid very quickly. If you've spent a long time watching and haven't seen him yet though, it's time to venture down into the stores and clear them slowly. Sprinting is a great way to end up with Killa in your face before you're able to ready your gun. I normally start with Mantis, then make my way around to Viking, then Brutal, then go past Kibba into Adidas in general. If you don't find him, well, it's time to grab some loot and scoot. If I do come against him, you have to have quick reactions. You have to stun lock him before he starts blasting or he's just gonna knee slide into you and shove his RPK where the sun don't shine. Now at this point, he's dead or you've, you're dead, but let's assume he's dead. You and Killa probably just made a lot of noise, so loot fast. Killa has either an RPK, an AKM, or a decked out PP-19. The Killa helm, Killa armor. I recommend tossing on his gear if you didn't shred it, because it's probably better than what you're wearing. Or just toss the helm in your gamma for the Jaeger task and make your way out of the raid. Selling his helm is normally the call as it's rather cumbersome to use, but I like saving it for some beefy labs or factory runs. Enjoy your newfound knowledge on how to be a killer killer, and thanks for watching. Sorry for not putting out a video last week. I just started back at work again after my, recovering from my injury, and I haven't had much free time to make a good video, so I really wanted to take my time and get this right. Catch you guys next week.